Oh, Johnny's driving in his van, do da do da. Johnny's going to do some work, do da do da day. One thing about England which has always made me laugh, you know, uh, it can be cold, freezing one day, and then the day after it can be something like 25 degrees, and, uh, you know, that's Celsius, whatever the hell that is in uh, Fahrenheit, I don't know. Oh, it's the same when it's like summer, you know, uh, it, as soon as it hits like the, th the second week in September, that's it, boom, cold, cold. Brr. The other day when I was talking about uh, the green screen, um, yeah, and the light position, so basically this is all that it did. Uh, the lights uh, used the lights used to hang from here, but instead I extended the piece of wood uh, from each side and I hung them like this instead. And also I angled them slightly. They're not supposed to be angled that much, but never mind. And this one here is exactly the same. Now uh, I guess if you had uh, you know a pro proper camera like a 5D or or a 7D, you don't need to go that expensive really. But you know more expensive than the camera that I'm holding right now. Uh, you know the the Sony bloggies not the best camera that I've ever had and the reason why I had it is because I, I like this little the flip thing <laughs> you know that's on the side uh, you know so I could see myself but now they brought out the handheld cameras like the Canon that um, you know uh, Charles Strupp uses and everybody else um, you know and they've got the uh, little uh, mirror strip on the side so you can see yourself as you're doing it so you know that your face is going to be in the shot and uh, my sister just bought a camera which has got the uh, little uh, the little uh, LCD screen on the front of the camera as well so <laughs> either way there's so many much better cameras but the problem is with this camera is it's got this stupid auto brightness thing which I cannot turn off so when I've got the green screen behind it I've got to go in every single frame and then edit it that way so it's a pain in the ass. Do you know what's really really funny I've just noticed if you look at the side of my head here it kind of spikes up a little bit now that now that my hair is short. It's hard for me to put that back down again, even with glue or or glue, even with mousse or uh, hair gel or something. So, oh, I'm gonna have to keep an eye on that. <laughs> I didn't realize how silly it looked. Uh, yeah. So anyway, um, I just got asked to uh, fix a heater, so I fixed it like really really quickly. So now it works. So I've got a couple hours, and I've got the whole TV to myself, so yay, so I'm gonna play some Xbox. So, yes, yes, yes! Arr, Xbox! But what shall I play? Hmm. I don't know. Shall we, uh, you know, I could get all, all like fit and healthy, and uh, I could do a bit of, you know, Xbox Connect, a bit of dancing, or I could just sit on my ass and play Resident Evil. Well, I do need to complete the game, I mean, you know. You know, the sun's gone in, it's uh, almost half past six, and it's still a beautiful day. And it's still uh, really, really warm. I've seen probably the first classic car, you know, of the year. <laughs> you, know, um, you know, a nice VW Bug. Uh, actually, yeah, I saw, um, uh, I saw a blue Corvette, you know, uh, 19, 1984, I think. And, um, and it was a, what else is it? Um, a green MG, uh, MGB. Nothing fancier, but, you know. And uh, it's nice to see these cars about, and also a couple of motorcycles have been around, so yay, the weather's getting better. But it always does this, doesn't it? England, it, uh, it treats you for about a week of beautiful weather, and then it'll piss down for two months. Yeah, it's not going to do me any good. I've just been uh, educating Corolla in the Dropstick Murphys. Yeah, what do you oh, think? They're really cool, you have to watch them. Yep. <laughs> spice, yes, spice. <laughs> yeah, spice, spice, spice. Yeah, yeah. We were. Uh, it was the uh, the spicy McHaggis jig, I think uh, it's called, and uh, it's an awesome song. It reminds me of when uh, P Rock TV was on. Um, if you're from England, do, do you remember that P Rock TV? You know, uh, the Sky Channel. I think it was way before Sky Plus came out, and they had this. Um, 
uh, channel, uh, you know, on the music channels, just P Rock TV, Punk Rock TV, and uh, all the unsigned bands went on it, and all sorts of stuff, and uh, like uh, Whitmore, um, you know, what was that Japanese one, uh, you know, heavy metal band, and, uh, you know, uh, Mil, Mil Cullen, um, I can't remember who, who else they were, so, yeah, and here it is, yeah. <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah, how daft are we? Yeah. That that Down was us that was us attempting mushing, yeah, so it's like uh mushing's more like Okay, that's enough acting like a tit um for one night. So, uh, anyway, so I'll see you tomorrow, so good night, take care, and have fun.